the response from the peasants to all of this was riots and revolts. Again, the revolts were particularly bad because the peasants could see that after their grain was seized and brutally confiscated from them, it was sitting there rotting away in the railway wagons, in churches, in schools, and so forth, for lack of a better storage space. After the revolts, the state responded with use of tanks and bayonets and collectivization, which was often used as a punitive measure or to ensure that the peasants were unable to destroy or hoard the food because they were collectivized, although then the collective farms also did engage in hoarding. It was not so much that the state was insistent upon spreading collectivization fast across the country as it was a response to the problem of trying to ensure procurement of the grain.